Outlander Emmy Fike event delves into initial attraction of lovebirds Claire, Katrina Balfe, and Jamie, Sam Hewen. At Stars' recent Outlander Emmy Fike event moderated by Gold Derby's Tom O'Neill, Katrina Balfe and Sam Hewen opened up about the initial attraction of their lovelorn characters, Claire and Jamie, to a crowd of TV Academy members. Outlander creator, executive producer Ronald D. Moore, executive producer Meryl Davis, executive producer slash writer slash director Matthew B. Roberts, executive producer Tony Graffia and production designer John Gary Steele also joined in the discussion about season three of the Emmy-nominated drama series. Watch O'Neill's exclusive panel interviews with the cast and crew above. Claire and Jamie spend so much time apart and when they do get back together of course there's that initial attraction. Huen reflects about their dynamic in the third season. They're still the same people they were, but they've changed and I think they both question, is this relationship gonna work? They have to rediscover who they are as a couple again. Balf adds that the version of Claire we meet in season 3 is so different, explaining that she's just returned to Frank, she's just lost the love of her life, she's just been through this insane experience and she somehow has to shelve all of that and go on living. She's about to give birth to a baby, so a lot of that drive to survive and keep her life going is for her unborn child. Claire is a woman without intimacy, Balf reveals. The whole passionate side of her personality she's had to completely put to one side. She sort of lives with the ghost of this man who changed her entire being. And so it's almost like Claire is two different people in this season. When Claire and Jamie finally reunite, it's almost like the layers come off. As soon as she sees him. She begins to open up. Overall season 3 is a transitional season, says more about the world traveling episodes. Literally and metaphorical it's moving the characters from one chapter in their lives to another. So we start in Scotland, we cross the ocean, end up in Jamaica and then the new world. The characters too are transitioning between the past and the present and then on to the future. The cast and crew also talk about the famous kiss of life when Jamie dives down to save Claire from drowning in the hurricane. He gives her air by way of a passionate kiss, which O'Neill confesses is his favorite moment of season 3 due to its heightened romanticism. Hewan jokes about Jamie, he's got a big set of lungs. Be sure to make your Emmy predictions today so that Hollywood insiders can see how their TV shows and performers are faring in our odds. You can keep changing your predictions as often as you like until just before nominees are announced on July 12th. And join in the fun debate over the 2018 Emmy taking place right now with Hollywood insiders in our television forums. Read more Gold Derby Entertainment News.